Iron overdose is the leading cause of death because of toxicological agents in children younger than 6 years old. Iron may be used as vitamin supplement and for treatment of anemia is very applicable for children because it appears similar to cancer. Patients with anemia that require frequent blood transfusion are also at high risk of developing chronic iron toxicity. Chronic iron toxicity may affect on organs such as liver and heart. The death may occur due to myocardial cirrhosis. Clinical presentation A lot of patients may vomit although they didn't ingest a toxic dose for, of iron. Iron ingestion may cause GIT symptoms such as vomiting, diarrhea, and hemorrhagic gastroenteritis. Even in the absence of ingestion of iron, people may suspect iron ingestion. Hyperglycemia with metabolic acidosis may occur during the abdominal pain or gastroenteritis. There are five stages of iron toxicity. Understanding the course of toxicity is very important, especially the second recovery stage, which may lead physician resulting premature and inappropriate discharge of patient. Stage 1. Gastrointestinal stage. This stage occurs within 6 hours after exposure. This phase is characterized by abdominal pain and diarrhea. In severe intoxication, hemorrhage conjugate with the gastroenteritis fluid and blood loss may occur resulting in hypovolemia or shock. Fatigue may occur in the first stage in a lot of people. Stage 2. It is a latent stage. It is characterized by resolution of GIT symptoms. In this stage, patients start to improve and recover. This stage occurs 6 to 12 hours after ingestion. It may last for 24 hours. This phase may include hypertension and metabolic acidosis. Stage 3. It is a metabolic or cardiovascular stage. It is characterized by metabolic acidosis and cardiovascular symptoms. Higher concentration of iron produced polyspacing fluids, which is characterized by CNS symptoms like coma. Most patients die in this stage, which occur early 6 to 8 hours due to ingestion and severity of exposure. This stage lasts to up to 2 days. The acidosis may cause failure of many organs such as heart and kidney. Stage 4. It is the hepatic stage. The level of bilirubin may be elevated and hepatic dysfunction is observed. Hypoglycemia may also occur. Stage 5. It is a stage characterized by scarring of the healing GIT. Its tunnel obstruction and gastric outlet may occur due to stomach and or intestine may be affected. This phase lasts for 6 weeks after severe poisoning. Differential Diagnosis When we are dealing with patients with similar presentation, we should think about including diabetic ketoacidosis. Regular gastroenteritis may differ types of toxicity, including alcohol, arsenic, mercury, aspirin, and cyphelin. Treatment Include IV fluids and whole bowel irrigation. Emesis and gastric lavage are not recommended. Dysfroxamine is a bleeding agent of choice for iron toxicity and may be administ administered IM or IV. Finally, call the emergency to do what is needed for the case.